Hey guys, so today's video is a haul video. I just wanted to let you know that this is not sponsored whatsoever. I just got a lot of stuff in the mail lately and I just wanted to share with you just in case something spots your eye and you wanted to try it out too. Some of these things are PR packages. Some of it I bought on my own and I just wanted to share everything with you guys because I honestly never get this much stuff at once. So if anything catches your eye and you want me to do a review on it before you go buy it, just let me know in the comments below. And also subscribe at the button below and be sure to turn on your notifications to be notified whenever I upload. So the first place I'm gonna start with is Ulta and Sephora. I just got it all in this cute little Sephora bag that I got with my points from Sephora. Um, I really like these kind of tote bags. But I have the Ulta and Sephora stuff mixed in together. So I'll just let you know what's from Ulta and what's from Sephora. The first thing that I got from Ulta was these Ardell lashes. And they these are the Wispies. And I actually have them on right now. If you want to see a tutorial on this makeup look, just click the card right there. It'll come up and take you straight to the video. Wispy lashes are like my favorite kind of lashes. So I really like these and I like Ardell because of the fact that the lash band is really thin and it's really easy to apply and it's not too heavy on your eyelids if you're not used to wearing false lashes like me. So yeah, I really like these. Okay, the next thing I got from S Ulta, I got this from Ulta. And it's the Tony Moly, I think that's how you say it. It's the three-step nose strip blackhead remover. And I had bought two of these just in case I like them. And if you want a demo and review on this, just let me know in the comments below. Honestly, this, I, all I'm gonna tell you now, it smells really good. It smells like strawberries. Hint, a big strawberry on the front. But yeah, if you want to see a demo or review or just something small on Instagram, just let me know in the comments below. And the next thing I got from Ulta is the Pores Be Pure Skin Clarifying Mud Mask with Strawberry and Yarrow. I don't know what Yarrow is and I don't even know if I'm saying it right. Yarrow? It says this skin refining mask with berry boosters goes straight to work on clogged pores. But yeah, it's just like I've been really liking masks lately. So I wanted to invest in something that would really like suck everything out of my pores. I have not tried this yet. I'll let you know in future videos if this works. I am really excited about this because I am excited about any mask that I get my hand on. And from Sephora, I got, of course, this tote bag that I did tell you about. And the thing I got from Sephora was one of these Sephora Rose Lip Masks and this one's the softening and moisturizing one and I did use one of these already and I might post a demo on Instagram so stay tuned for that I don't want to give my thoughts about it now because I only used it once I like to use things at least twice to be able to give an opinion like I never seen one like a sheet mask and the last thing I got from Sephora was the pearl sleeping mask. And I honestly love sleeping masks. I love overnight masks because my skin really absorbs the serums and everything overnight. I really think that if you have troubled skin to invest in some overnight masks, this one's supposed to perfect and brighten your skin. So I'm really, 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 really hoping that I like this because I absolutely love overnight masks. And the next thing I want to show you is a PR package from Pop Beauty. And oops, I knew that was gonna happen. And I honestly love their packaging. Like how cute is this? And just drop everything, okay? But in this it says matte or high shine gloss. Whichever you prefer, we have what you need for a pop of perfect pout. And it comes with three matte velvet lipsticks, pink porcelain, cozy crimson, and finest fuchsia. Color true and pigment rich. This innovative lipstick texture coats lips in bold color with just one swipe. And these retail for $16 each. And the plump pout lip gloss, I got peony petal, fuchsia freesia, and bare nectar. Plumping pout perfector combines the high shine of a lacquer gloss with the long wear of a stain and is packed full of lip plumping peptides and avocado and jojoba oils. And these also retail for $16. 
My next place I went to is Target because my Target was redoing their planograms and they had a lot of stuff on sale. And my first thing is this shampoo and conditioner. I am really not sure how to say that M word. I think it's Monoy. Monoy? I don't know, but it's the coconut oil nourishing shampoo and conditioner. And I used this on my hair and it my hair loves it. I think this is a really good see interrupting again. Why do you always want to do that? Mm -hmm. But I really like these. Um, I used them once and my hair was so soft after I got out of the shower. So I'm happy I found another shampoo and conditioner that I like. These retailed for like $5.99 I think each. So $10, $12 for shampoo and conditioner. Not bad. And they smell so good. It smells like coconut milk and like shea butter the next item that i got from target is the maybelline colossal big shot volume mascara I'm excited for this i'm actually going to take it out of the package right now because next time i do my makeup i'm going to use it and nail troubles goodness but maybelline is like one of my favorite drugstore mascara brands like their their mascara be on point and i got more lashes from target i got the ardell double up lashes i think it's just short and medium um, it's the individual lashes. I like to add them on to lashes that I don't really like. I like to make them more full. And then I got the Ardell Faux Mink Lashes. Um, I seen someone else have these and I was like, ooh, I gotta get these. And I, and I got two things from e.l.f. I got the baked highlighter, which I used and I have it on right now. I have it as a highlight and on my brow bone and in my inner corner. This is the shade Pink Diamonds, and I love pink highlights. When you use these, you need to wipe off the top. And then this next product I got from e.l.f. was the e.l.f. Molten Eye Liquid Eyeshadow in Rose Gold. And I'm just going to tell you now, I'm going to go get the rest of them because these are so gorgeous. I have them on my, I have it on my lid right now, but I did put a shadow over, over top. But it is so gorgeous. I will... Well, I'll swatch both of these for you. But yeah, these are really, really good. And it, I don't see any creasing. They blend out so nice. Like these e.l.f. Please make more shades of this because I am in love with this formula. My local Target finally got Soap and Glory. Like, I flipped out when I seen the whole display, the makeup, the lotion the face wash everything they have everything there and i am obsessed with their hand food if you've ever tried this you know how soft your hands are going to be after using this um and the smell it smells so so good like i am so happy i finally was able to restock on this i went through like three of the little ones so i just went ahead and got a big one and the next thing i want to share with you is from pixie i will insert a clip right here because it is way too big for me to show you the whole thing on camera but i will be going through the products that they did send me this is i just want you to see how big this box is like look at this it's like yeah thank you pixie for this so much i am like in love with it okay and the first thing out of this box it, it's called the pixie pretties collection and they collaborated with some beauty bloggers and the first thing is from caroline hirons i might butcher some of these names this is pixie plus caroline it's the double cleanse half the first half is a cleansing oil the second half is a cleansing cream and I am not going to open this because it is kind of messy. I did insert a clip of it as you can see. But I'm really excited to try this because I just, I, I, I need help removing my makeup. Like, I wear so much. So, in the next collaboration they sent me was the Itch Judy Time palettes. One's a eye palette and the other one's a lip palette. I will swatch a few colors for you because I did not swatch any of these um, because I really did want to save them for this video. I love this packaging and it came with a little mirror to customize the placement and I ended up putting them on the back of 
these palettes. So this is a lip palette. It comes with 12 different lip colors. I never have tried a lip palette before. I'm going to swatch one. I don't want to. It looks so perfect. I don't even want to mess it up, but I'm going to swatch one. Um, I'll swatch this shade and it's called Beaded It. I'm going to swatch it. It does have a good color payoff. One swipe is not a lot of pigment. I'm going to swatch this darker shade. It's right here. And this one's called Sultry. So let's just see what that's all about. Ooh, that is so gorgeous. And I've never owned a lip palette at all. Ooh, that one's pretty. And then this eye palette, like I am dying. I'm dying for mostly shades. Like this is like, she did her thing with this. So these are the shades that I swatched. This one is Night Night. This one is Getaway. And this one is Good Morning. I am dying for this middle shade. I want to use it in a tutorial so bad. And the next collaboration I will be sharing from Pixie that came in this box is from Aspen Ovard. Aspen Novard? Aspen Ovard. I don't know how to say her last name. I will link all of their Instagrams below so you can take take a look at them and their YouTubes. Um, she came out with three powders and a eye accents set and the eye accent set is the lower lash mascara and the brow tamer the pink one is called rome rose and i have it on right now as blush and the last collaboration that came in this palette is from Miriam. i am really not sure how to say her last name she came out with this strobe and sculpt brush it's a highlight and contour brush duo and honestly it's so soft and then there's these two um highlight and bronzer slash contour palettes and the last couple things i got are from cargo they sent me these things to try and i used some of this palette oh, i just hit myself in the mouth huh? i just used some of this palette it's called you had me at aloha and the shades in here are so pretty it comes with a eyeliner a makeup brush and 12 eyeshadows and my camera is dying so I'm gonna have to hurry up and go, go through these quickly and then they gave me their cargo HD illuminating palette which comes with a bronze a beam and a bright and the last thing that they sent me was this mattifying primer and I have not used this yet either um I'm excited to use this because I am oily and yeah oils and makeup don't mix well together so i'm really excited to try a mattifying primer because i have not honestly found one that combats my oils 100 percent so that is all for this video if you like haul videos just give this video a thumbs up and let me know that you want more and also you can subscribe at the button that's right here and i will see you in my next video